Hello everyone, how you doing? Welcome to Game Tech UK. I am on my way. In fact, I'm not on my way. I'm here now. <laughs> how are you all? Hopefully, yeah, stop spamming on my way now. Otherwise, I won't play again. And Max, that was some crazy uh, spamming from you there, son. Um, so I'm over here on the right-hand side. That's where I'm going to be, just above the navigation. Um, I've got a game to show you that's coming out next Thursday, which is the 25th. It's going into early access. It is PC only. Okay, there's no plans to bring this to um, console. It's the same people that brought you Firm Bus um, and Tourist Bus. So they've got, um, they haven't really got a sort of history of porting their games to console. This is on the Unreal Engine as well. So it's running way better than on the road. It looks absolutely glorious. It really, really does look well. Um, and there's not much. Um, to show you in terms of gameplay um, it really is early access and I'm going to go through I'm going to show you exactly what they've got planned it looks like they've got three different phases um, planned for you in, in early access but um, I think I can't pin them down on an exact price obviously you'll know that next Thursday I think it's going to be about £25 throughout the early access period but um, yeah hopefully you're all well hopefully you've all it's Chris <laughs> hopefully you've all had a lovely weekend I certainly have I've just finished my lovely lamb roast. Um, yeah, just like Omsi. Yeah, exactly, Kaleem. Yeah, the, I think that stuff is quite complex, and you'll see from the graphics as well. It, it's a very, very beautiful looking title. And the idea of this game is that um, it's a one to one of Berlin. So it's not a cut down version. Um, this is a one to one real life version of Berlin. Now, I don't think all the routes are in yet, um, as I'll show you in a minute on when we get to the early access. Um, it says it's coming to console there's a roadmap and they say it's coming now i've just spoken to fabian and it's not so we're not gonna we're not gonna go down that rumor um route i've just asked him i've asked him to double confirm and he said it's not planned so i've put not coming to console because it's not um tourist bus never come uh firm bus never come to console so yeah yeah that's fine right okay so yeah hopefully you've all had a lovely weekend i've just finished my beautiful lamb roast it was oh, i am king of the roast i tell you um so yeah chill out i'm going to be here for um hour and a half two hours something like that um and we're just going to chill with it so uh let me say some lovely names before we get on uh we've got melody mate mars is here pete is here chuckle pro we've got kaleem mark snowden lamb roast is the best oh, it's uh, i can still taste it. it it was special uh chris we've got reggae we uh reggae sorry we've got uh joff we've got martin we've got sadie Oh, God, you're going fast now. Davidoff's here. James, Sam, DBW. We've got PJ. Uh, British Ace is here. We've got Dale. Gordon. Hello, Gordon. We've got Lewis, Daniel. We've got uh, Lee's here. Peter Kitchen. Oh, you're not a lamb kind of guy. We've got Max here. Max, stop spamming it now, please. Um, we're done. Uh, Cheech is here. Nick. We've got Gaming Spectrum. Stimson is here, of course. And Pete is here, of course. Um, yeah, no console. So, that, you know, it's, and maybe you'll see, actually. Madman's here. Maybe you'll see when I show you the actual game. Maybe why it doesn't come to console. It's quite a complex game. Uh, graphically, it's going to be quite big. It already looked good. Let me just show you one thing before we start. So we're going to start now. So 
like I say, hopefully you've had a a, a nice um, a nice weekend. I've got a nice cup of tea. You know what we're like here. You know what I'm like. There's no rush, right? Oh, of course, homemade. Why wouldn't you have homemade? Of course. Um, there's no rush, so it's all good. Right, let me show you um, this, actually, which is their Steam page. So this is coming out. Um, it's going into early access, um, and the bus is the next generation of city bus driving simulation set in the capital of Germany, Berlin, on a real realistic scale of one to one transport passengers on different lines across the city with various buses manage your fleet and team up with other drivers online so it is going to be uh, multiplayer as well but the bit i want to show you which is important is the phases so let me show you exactly what you're going to get if you are going to buy this next thursday um, and i will obviously be showing you as well why does it look zoomed in let me have a look uh, no that, that should be fine yeah it looks normal doesn't it a one-to-one -one scale is crazy and like i say you wait to see the graphics that the strong point of this game is um is the graphics it looks absolutely beautiful so phase one is what you'll be getting so you'll be getting a bus line txl with various routes and we'll go through some of those routes today you're going to get two bus variants that's articulated bendy bus and solo they are scania citywide buses so you're only going to get scania to start with we've it is zoomed in. We can't see you. No, you shouldn't be seeing me. You, I'm just showing you the um, Steam page. Yeah, I'm just showing you the Steam page. Look. Yes, it's, it's not um, not meant to be showing you me. It's not about me. <laughs> it's not about me. Uh, yeah, so you can see that um, text, can't you? That's what I'm showing you is the text. Um, so single player, fr single player free play mode. Drive the bus lines at any time of the year with the vehicle of your choice. So that's what you can basically do. Um, I know, just saying it's zoomed in. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay um passenger transport with boarding and deboarding um and passenger ticket scale uh sale sorry so um this is this is effectively what i'm going to show you today so no it isn't pre-recorded <laughs> so you're going to get a bus line txl with various routes we're going to have two buses uh we're going to have the single player free play mode we, we can transport passengers with boarding and deboarding so we can watch them getting on and off and um a pa passenger ticket sell so we're going to be able to let me get back on so you're all happy there we are look just just calm all right just calm <laughs> So in phase one, um, you're only going to be able to, there's, there's no, there's no, um, there's no career as such. You're only going to be able to free play with two buses around certain routes. That's what you're going to get. So let's have a look at what is going in early access phase two. Now this, um, this, uh, this, gonna, this is going to last, the early access is going to last um, between um, 12 and 16 months. That's the information I've been given. So phase two, so moving on from just driving around um, and sort of picking up and dropping people off, uh, phase two, and there's no date when this is coming, but phase two will be modding tools for Unreal Engine. So this is in the in, in Unreal as well. Uh, you're going to get a multiplayer mode as well for free play. Additional bus line 100 and 200 with various routes. We're going to have two new bus variants. I'm not sure what they are, if they're going to be variants of um, Scania or whether they're going to be different brands. Um, AI buses. So you're not going to see any AI buses in today's video or stream, um, but they are coming. True to original depot uh, with connection to all bus lines. So we're going to get some, um, uh, uh, some depots as well. And full controller support for xbox and playstation 4 controllers so in phase two you're no there is ai no no just chill there is ai but not bus ai so you're not going to see any buses um so that's going to be phase two so they're giving you at least they're giving you some idea um of what 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 they've got planned so free phase three which will be basically um be the last phase will be the bit we all want really which is the single player economy mode um create your own bus company buy vehicles and hire staff maintain and repair the vehicles of your fleet and generate income via ticket sales that's really the bit we want so the game i suppose isn't actually going to come until the very end which is phase three so at least you know hopefully this information helps you um whether it's something you want to buy into um 
your face is hidden behind chat. My face isn't on the camera at the moment. <laughs> Stop worrying if I'm not on the camera. I haven't got to be on the camera all the time. I'm going through information first to give you all the information. So multiplayer mode for economy is going to be in there as well. Additional bus line 245 with various routes. Final bus variant. I don't know what that is. Again, is that going to be um, Scania? He's dragging this out. Leave off, widow. <laughs> dragging it out giving you the information so people don't ask the same question over and over again ai trams that's going to be quite interesting actually to have ai trams because obviously it's german so you've got trams going across the road that would be really cool announcements and npc audio dialogues nothing's in um, about that at the moment open hub free roaming area between berlin central station um, including the Tiergarten tunnel and complete tutorials and checklists so that's there's three different phases without me like padding it out giving you the proper information which i know is what a lot of people have come here for so we won't be we won't be stopping we'll be carrying on and giving you the right information at the right time we'll be able to create your own bus company scarab <laughs> yeah well the more information i give and not only that um this will go up as a video afterwards so a lot of people will actually watch the video and learn about what's included in the game before they decide whether they want to hand over their hard-earned money it takes me a few minutes to go through all the information and i think that's worthwhile to give you the right information so if that's too slow for you off you go right okay so we're going to get straight in well after i've had me tea let me make sure i've got you on the right screen actually that's it that's all correct here we go so this is going to be i don't know if this is the final um if this is the final interface i don't know but there will be um, a multiplayer area that's not available yet mods will come that's phase two um economy that's phase phase three um, we've got options save games tutorials that's going to be phase three um we've got the map actually which oh no that's not working uh free play this is basically what you've got so if you're going to buy into this game early access this is where you're going to be spending your time so we can drop off and pick up passengers we can give out tickets but that's not going to go um towards any campaign until phase three Right, okay, so the vehicle, we've got two vehicles, we've got, they're both Scania citywide, we've got the 18 metre one, can we just see the mirrors? You'll be impressed with the mirrors, in fact I think graphically you will be impressed with this game, it's the Unreal Engine and when you see it I think you're going to like it. And this is the early access as well, so two buses, we've got the Scania citywide, um, 18 metre which is the bendy bus or articulated and the 12 meter single so actually the single can be a little bit harder to drive we found this in bus sim didn't we where the single um, is longer than half of the articulated so sometimes it's actually harder to drive the single um, rather than the bendy bus but we will we will start with the bendy bus um, the line and tour now these are all the different routes that you can have um, currently in the game so we can pick we can pick any route we want also you can do um, you can put it to any time of the year now you'll be able to do this in the game obviously but this is is usually useful now because um obviously we've only got free play so to make it interesting for yourself you can change the date around we'll keep it to today's date uh, which is march the 23rd and we'll just go maybe midday something like that there you go uh, weather we can choose from sunny rain in storm fog and fog and rain in as well and it does snow in the game if you put it there uh we can hear your voice in game yet and not this one at least i don't think so uh okay so we're just gonna have uh, let's go sunny and let's start barry thank you very much i appreciate that thank you yeah you can have a storm we'll be trying it all out tonight as well um so yeah we'll just just chill relax i'll try and show you as much as i possibly can to give you the educa educated choice <laughs> eye repairing yeah <laughs> right okay so this is our bus so like I say this is Berlin and this is the Scania citywide 18 meter bendy bus 
So all the buses are fully licensed. You can see that, you know, they're up to the standard here, I think, of um, bus M18 for sure. I don't think they're moving it any forward anymore. Um, and they are up to the standard of bus sim um, 18 and 21, so that's all good. Right, so that's first job is to um, open the doors. You can open all the doors separately. Let me know what the volume's like, um, please, if you can. Right, okay. Now, the first thing you've got to do is go to the ticket machine and start your route. So we're going to click start, and our tour number is 55408. Once you do that, the bus is all working, and we're all up and ready for business. So here we go. Right, now, he, I, I quite like the way they're doing... Um, their ticket system so we go to the ticket he wants a single ticket he wants ABC route and uh, we're gonna click um, there you go now his ticket comes out we actually have to take his money which I think is pretty cool so we take his money and he wants 20 uh, 20 euro change there you go I actually quite like the way they're doing um, they're doing their month their, you know the, the ticket system We've also got up here, we, we can press this button to cycle through all the CCTV, which is quite cool. There's quite a bit going on here. Yeah, quite a bit going on. And you can um, go to all of these as well, individually. And depending on how you set up your controls, you can have control of absolutely everything. Um, I've, I've set up things like lights and uh, uh, wipers just automatically. Um, <laughs> no, W, no, they don't. <laughs> so, yeah, we've got all this and all of it moves. It's cool. It's cool. I've actually been enjoying, um, enjoying playing it, I must say. Right, let's close the doors. Let's go there. Why is that? That's not right. That's not. Yeah, there we go. Right, let's get going. Oh, it's because my steering was out. That's why. Yeah, that's why. That's cool. So there doesn't seem to be much engine sound at the moment. I'm not sure why that is. And I have tried setting, um, playing with the settings, and it doesn't seem. Um, I mean, you can hear it, but it's not too loud. But what you'll notice here is that the graphics are absolutely lovely and the detail is really, really cool. And you've got all the... I mean, I love Germany anyway. I will go to Germany, maybe even this year or next year. But Germany is represented um, very, very nice. We've got our own bus lane as well. And you can see there's plenty of people walking around, there's plenty of traffic, there's loads of bits going on with regards to, you know, like um, roadworks and all that sort of stuff. Can you put the mirror, uh, can you put, can you put right mirror on? Doesn't seem to be um, an option for that at the moment. But thank you for coming in everyone, spending a little bit of your Sunday uh, with me. Feel free to leave me a little cheeky like. Um, feel free to subscribe, whatever you want to do. No, there isn't, um, let's have a look. We can show you the options actually, that's quite important. Um, so we've got tutorial which isn't in yet. Event frequency, I think that's probably um, a bit similar to do with bus sim, maybe people leaving um, behind. Volume is not too loud. Oh, okay, it's all right, is it? Yeah, yeah, good. Yeah, we've got fumes as well coming out, which is pretty good. Um, so you've got all these other things here. You can do all the camera movements. Obviously, being PC, you can um, you can change everything. Basically, you could even drive it with with the mouse as well. Um, I've got the traffic density right up. The pedestrian um, density is right up as well. I'm running it in 2K, but I'm running everything on Epic, and you'll see it's running pretty good and that's without any optimization as well in early access. Um, but no, there's nothing to put. Um, there's nothing to put the mirrors on at the moment. Yeah, the, the sound sounds all right outside, but maybe they've um, maybe they've deadened it too much on the inside. 
but that's fine we're not here to you know it's early access so at least i'm just giving you an idea of whether it's something that you want to um whether you want to get into also it's got a nice look left and right system just like bus sim which i think is cool and that always makes me happy you know that <laughs> you know that always makes me happy All right, we're just going to pull up here. And let's open the doors. Front, middle, and back as well. Could, if they could bring similar graphics to Bus Sim 21. Well, I think Bus Sim 21, I mean, looked as detailed as this. I think the difference is, is that this has gone for sort of like a... I think they've gone for a much more realistic look for this. Bus Sim has always been um, not... Um, it's a take on reality, I think, Bus Sim. I don't know whether you'll agree or not, um, but this is this seems to have gone for just pure. Let's try and make it as uh, as real as possible. Yeah, I don't know whether you'll agree with that. Right, let's close them doors. I like these little bits, you know, where you can you can scroll through and see what everyone's doing. I like that. It is quite cool. I like it. I must. I must say, I've um, I've been playing it for a little while now, and um, although there's not much to do, Scarab, I can see that Scarab. <laughs> you little wind up. <laughs> you little wind up, and I'll be showing you. Um, um, I'll be showing you all different times of day and weather as well. So just chill out. I'll try and show you um, as much as I possibly can. Where has I can see that? <laughs> Where's my route gone? Oh, there it is up there. That's a bit weird. There's no orange. Oh, there is now. Yeah. Oh, you... <laughs> it didn't come up on screen though, did it? Did it come up on screen? <laughs> there we go. Let's see if anyone's going to want any tickets. It doesn't seem that you can. Um, <laughs> this car of you get. Hey, she wants a ticket. So we go to um, the ticket. I do like this idea of them putting the actual um, change down. It's not always change as well. It most certainly did come up on screen. <laughs> oh, God. No, don't do that. Don't do that. <laughs> you little shit. Oh, God. It's not always change that they put down either. They do put notes down. So what does she, what does she want? She wants a single ticket. Um, a, B... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, early access though, game, so hopefully that will change, but um, yeah, hopefully. There we go, there's the ticket. And she wants one euro back. Nice one. Yeah, we can certainly forgive that. Um, we can forgive that at the moment, because it is the first phase of early access. Now, don't forget, this is the same people that brought you Firm Bus. You, you can tell that by um, a lot of stuff in the game. Um, the menus and the sat-nav and the way the bus stops um, uh, have got the H around it, it's all exactly the same. I don't know about the Unreal Engine um, Amco, yeah, I'm not sure about that. I don't know why the actual route has disappeared off of my sat-nav. I'm not entirely sure uh, where to go next. I think we can check that out, though. I think we can. Where are we? We're up here. So we want to go right here. Cool. Is Bus Sim 21 coming to console? Yes, James. That's all right, Uma. Yeah, it's, it's part of the job, isn't it? It's all good. Not everyone um, comes in at the same time and asks the same question and gets the same answer. I'm always, um, you know, uh, patient with people. It's not a problem, you yeah. So there are going to be um, there are going to be proper bus um, what are they called like depots in there as well. Have you missed a stop? I don't think so. Yeah, I mean, I, I don't think so. Can you still check tickets? No, check tic <laughs> check tickets. No, it doesn't seem that you can um, check tickets. No, no, it doesn't. Day night cycle. We've got it on dynamic, so yes. Any news on the game? What do you mean, James? What the 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 the, uh, <laughs> the game I'm playing now? Oh, okay, Joseph. Okay, mate. How are you? Hello, Slim. Yeah, it hasn't been. Um, I've played it today, and the route has been working absolutely, uh, absolutely fine. 
Let me just double check that. Yeah, it looks like we're going down the right way. Might might be. Oh, it's come back now. Yeah, it's come back. Maybe it's something to do with this route. Remember, um, early access. It even says when you load up the game. It's early access. There's three phases. There will be bugs. It actually says there will be lots of bugs. But look at the look at the environment. I mean, graphically, I think this is probably. Um, one if not the best looking bus simulator um, currently it looks good it's got lots of detail lots of detail actually yeah lots of detail and it is going to be a one-to-one -one, um, representation of, um, of Berlin I think it looks lovely I really do yeah let's open all our doors they do seem to get off too quick at the back actually um, so we'll report that back. How does this perform uh, compared to tourist bus? Probably the same, Chubby. Yeah, probably. It's going to be about £25, Amco. Can you get out of the bus? Yes, you can. Yeah, we'll show that in a minute. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, there is a pinned message, which is right there in blue. So please read that. Right, okay. Here we go. Let's shut that door. The rain is pretty good in it as well, but it just shows you the the difference in quality between Unity and Unreal. That that's that's what I'm getting from this. Obviously, these are probably a far more um, experienced um, developer. They're TML. They do Fern Bus. Um, they do Tourist Bus. They do um, quite a few games. But this is what they're experienced at. And um, yeah, I mean, I, I think it looks cool. I think it looks good. I think it looks the best um, city version of to drive around in in a bus simulator so far without a doubt yeah if there is James I'd make a, another video on that I wouldn't share it with this particular game <coughs> here we go so at the moment yeah they all look um, they're probably straight out of phone bus to be honest with you um, but yeah we'll, we'll, we'll accept that for now it's early access isn't it so in terms of what you get with early access, you get exactly what we're seeing here. There's lots of um, there's lots of routes, um, and you can drive any of them at any time of day in any weather um, situation. But that's what you get in early access. Um, you don't get the um, you know the e ecosystem, the economy system, or start up your own company or anything like that until phase three. Yeah, it looks like Lidl's up there, yeah, yeah. I mean, look, there's a, there's a lot of AI stuff going on, isn't there? And a lot of... I mean, look at that. There's a lot of detail here. We will go for a walk around um, a little bit later as well. But, I mean, there's, <laughs> there's a fair chunk of detail in this game. Can you turn off the money machine? Uh, I don't know, but why would you want to? You'd just play Euro Truck then, wouldn't you? <laughs> I think you can see probably why it wouldn't come to console. I mean, it's it's looking very detailed, and again, if they bring it to console, it's got to work on the Xbox standard. It's got to work on the PlayStation Four. You know, this is a good time for them to go right. We'll bring it out, but it's for next gen. That would be great. Yeah, that would be great. Oh, there we go. All right, okay, let's go to the ticket machine. Uh, let's do the ticket first. Single ticket, A, B, and one of them. Um, it, the, the price is £3. You have to take the money by clicking on it. And we've got to give him one euro change. There you go. Not a problem. What are you doing, love? You coming on or what? They do love a phone. <laughs> I actually like it. I, you know, I like I like bus sim anyway. You know, I do. There's something there's something about bus sim. I do like it. I like having fun with it. But I'm actually every I'm looking everywhere, and there is detail, literally everywhere. And the AI seems to behave properly. You know, I, I think for early access, although there isn't a lot to do, there's only routes. You, you know, you can only um, just try routes basically. There's nothing to do in early access. You know, there's no money or anything like that. But I'm looking around and I'm just seeing a lot of detail here. I'd love to know your opinion as well. Are you seeing that? Um, do you think it looks good? 
There's more than two models of cars. Yeah, 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 exactly. Yeah, look at all the mirrors that ain't coming to console. Yeah, I think it would be probably too system hungry for the original Xbox um, and um, PlayStation as well. Why are you come? Why are you asking three times? Honestly, <laughs> it does look good. Yeah, I, I like it. I like it. No, you can't check tickets at the moment. No, no, you can't check tickets. But imagine when um, they've got the trams working as well. You'll see when we go through the city centre, they've got all the tram lines and power lines up ahead or, or overhead. Um, there's a lot of detail gone into it, I must say. Yeah, I'm quite, I, I'm quite taken with, with the way it looks, I must say. Yeah, they come out the back door way too early. Way too early. The AI doesn't look similar, doesn't seem to be five bra men, yeah. <laughs> Would it be in emissions? Yeah, of course. That's. I will go back a couple of times throughout the stream, actually, um, and just show you that early access. Now you know what I'm looking at. Or na I showed you before I started the game. So now you've seen the game, obviously it might you know, sink in a little bit more about um, what you're actually getting. Is it just the one bus? Uh, no, yeah, you've got one brand, which is the Scania um, Citywide. You've got a Bendy, which is 18 metres, or you've got a 12 metre single. We'll do that next. Oh, she's here. Hang on, hang on. We've got a ticket. So she wants a single and AB, same route. That's fine. I like the way you actually... It's a shame they don't take it. It's a shame you don't see their arm. Just take it. But um, we actually take their money, which is cool. And one euro change. There you go. Very strange horn. Yeah, exactly, Baz. I think that, um, you know, TML, firm bus, tourist bus, it's not on console, isn't it? I don't think they've got a history with um, bringing games to console. They've, they've, got their, they've got a good following, and they're probably a bit like SES. They're just probably just happy doing what they're doing. Um, yeah, so I don't think this will... Well, I've asked Fabian himself, and he said there, there are no plans to bring this, so I can only go on there. Yes, yeah, it's, it's Berlin, and when it come when it's finished, it's going to be a one-to-one -one representation. Um, so every road in this game will be the same as the real Berlin. So every side street, everything will be exactly the same. Wouldn't it be great if I did in, did that in London? I love it. Yeah, that would be fantastic. Want to see dynamic? Yeah, yeah. Well, I'll, I'll put the dynamic on next, actually. Right, so here's the tram stuff overhead, which I think looks absolutely fantastic. Uh, and imagine when we start seeing trams going along. That's going to be really cool. Yeah, Fabian is a nice guy. Yeah, I think he's got a lot on his plate, that's for sure. But, um, yeah, he is a nice guy. And it's nice to have um, it's nice to have a contact at a company like Aerosoft, because they, they produce the games that I like to play. So, yeah. Is it easy to set up the wheel? Yeah, you just go in and, and set it up, yeah. You ca Can you put virtual mirrors? Not at the moment, Kyle. Or not that I could see, anyway. Yeah, not at the moment. Yeah, definitely Wilkins, yeah. But I'm going to show you the other bus. I'm going to show you nighttime, daytime, rain. Um, I'm going to show you winter as well, because you can put it to December and have snow. So I'll be showing you all that. Do you think there'd be physics behind the snow? Mm, I don't think... Uh, I have seen a few complaint, complaints, um, uh, uh, particularly with uh, some of Fabian's um, gameplay, going, oh, God, it looks arcade, oh, we want a simulator, but it drives like a bus. I mean, how, how simulator do you actually want it? Um, I don't think there'd be physics... Um, to do with snow honestly i don't think there will be maybe yeah yeah we'll put the storm on as well is it easy to look around with a button as well that's the beauty of um, pc gaming is that we've got the mouse but yes i can look left and right uh with them and uh we can change for our cctv i like that feature it's good no not look arcade drive arcade the way it pulls away the way it stops um yeah yeah Yeah, exactly, Mark. Yeah, uh, Mark. Sorry. Yeah, it's good to have him coming in. Yeah. 
Right, here we go. You get this little um, uh, camera up there, this little virtual camera, just showing you what's going on with the closing of the doors. It would be about £25. I couldn't um, narrow him down on the official cost. He said about €25, Euros, so might be 20 quid, might be 25 quid. Um, have you tried the... Uh, yeah, you can set the Madman, but it was just a bit slow. Yeah, it's got... It's a bit like Bussim, actually. It's got the analogue look, but it's also got one press, which I've gone up to the gears. Um, I mean, look at that, look. It's also got that as well, so I'm quite happy with the way um, the way it's all set up. 25 quid, yeah. You can open the window. You can set a button for that. Yeah, you can open the window. There's not much in the way of false feedback at the moment, apart from you get this like click, which you might be able to see on my wheel when you go over a pothole, so I'm sure they're going to work on that as well, but... The thing that's taken me is, is is the graphics. There's a lot of deeper detail as well. You know, it's not just roadside detail. There's a lot of, of deeper detail going on. I have, I have sort of noticed that, um, that we don't normally get in a game like this. You know, there's a lot of, um, a lot of stuff going on. They're obviously proud of their city. They're a German company. And um, yeah, I should imagine they're enjoying reproducing it in the game. Track IR does work. Um, true, yes, it does. Yeah, track IR, track IR does work. Did you say gears? No, no. Um, you've um, you've only got forward and reverse. Yeah. Yeah, the buses are automatic. Is it system hungry? I can play it in 4K with everything on Epic, but I just thought just for a little bit of headroom. Um, I'll put it on 2K, but it's 2K and everything is on Epic, and it, it's running fine. Yeah, running absolutely fine. I think, you know, if, if we do this, look, it's nice and smooth, isn't it? And I like the fact we've got a bit of diesel coming out there. I'll be honest, I actually like it. Um, in terms of, is it worth investing in the early access? It depends on how happy you are just going to be... Um, driving around because that's all you can do at the moment you can just experience or try out um, the routes there's no economy system there's no um, employing people there's no earning money you're just trying out um, the route so it depends on the, you know how much of a bus fan you are or you know how much you want a game like this you know in terms of if you, if you fancy this game as a as a finished article I'd probably say just wait till phase three or when it comes out. But if you if you want to get involved in it and um, watch it progress and you like what you see, then the early access will be there on the 25th. I don't think there's anything to... Apart from the way it looks and how promising it looks and the buses look nice and, you know, there's a lot going on. I don't think anyone could look at this and go, oh, this is a bit... Oh, this is a bit disappointing. It looks delicious. It really does look cool. So if, if you're quite excited about that, the early access comes out on the 25th if you're not fussed about that and you think well actually I'll just wait until the game's out lovely I will keep you absolutely informed um, uh, for when it comes out and each phase and each update I will cover it for you but I am actually enjoying it and I think that when um, when we've got a full economy staff you can employ um, you can employ sorry and um, other drivers you know trams other buses coming the other way yeah i think it's it's promising yeah it's promising whoa it does look impressive yeah i was um i was i was really pleasantly surprised after on the road as well and the, the struggle that is to sort of you know you sort of visualize how you would want it but it doesn't actually look like that i put this on and i was like bloody hell this actually looks really good it almost looks sort of next gen doesn't it and uh yeah this is before th this is early access so um there are optimizations to be done maybe there's graphical improvements i've got no idea but you know it does it, it definitely looks promising press tab and then oh just found out how do you put the press tab and then right mouse double click oh mirror oh i see oh okay okay Oh, well, thank you very much. Um, who said that? Who said that? Interesting. Don't think we really need that one. Can we move that up? No, you can't move that up. Yeah, there's quite a bit of adjustment in the game. 
and you can um, you can adjust the seat and the angle and you know where you look and all that sort of stuff. I'm not going to touch that because I've got it um, just how I like it. Yeah, no fog either. Yeah. Oh, well, you can have fog actually. Yeah, thank you to whoever said that. Um, who was it? Just so I can say thank you. But yeah, that's cool. Uh, right, let's get going. Yeah, same as Fernbus. Yeah, I should imagine they've reused quite a bit um, from Fernbus. But what they're trying to do is maybe Fernbus. You know, you've got the the longer journeys. This is very. Um, although it's going to be Berlin one to one, obviously being um, a bus game, it's going to be a lot shorter journeys like this. Oh, I got you, Chubby. Yeah, yeah. I don't know how how. Oh, I don't know how. Um, if they're going to change that at all, or whether they're going to be happy just porting it straight over um, in terms of UI and stuff. Germany looks lovely, though. This is making me want to go to Germany. I mean, it's on my list anyway to go, but this is actually making me want to go even more. It does look impressive, yeah. Yeah, after the debacle of um, on the road and, you know just the general problems and the fact that you have to make so many allowances it was really nice to put this on um, and just go wow <laughs> it looks nice it plays nice it runs nice this is and I just relax straight away yeah this is good yeah yeah it actually looks like like real life yeah is this modeled on a particular German s uh, city John yeah this is Berlin so this is a one-to-one -one, or it's going to be a one-to-one -one representation of Berlin so every single side street every crossing um, is, is, is going to be in the game it's unreal yeah yeah see you later Martin yeah exactly madman yeah I mean you know that's why I'm glad I'm, I'm here giving you information um, about what you actually get now you've seen the game let me just go back now um, so I can show you what um, there's three different phases. So as we've seen in this one, you're going to get. Uh, so if you buy the game on the 25th for about 25 pound, this is what you're going to get. What I've just shown you, and to list it, it's going to be bus line TXL with various routes, two buses. That's the articulated, which I've shown you. The solo I will show you next. Single player free play mode. Just demonstrated that passenger transport with boarding and deboarding we've seen that and passenger ticket sale we've seen that as well so the next phase so if you're going to get involved in this game the next bit that you can look forward to is modding tools so i mean that's going to open up um it's 21.95 oh, okay yeah so 25 euro 21 quid awesome so the next thing you can look forward to is modding tools for unreal 4 um so i don't know whether that means you can start downloading mods or making your own i've got no idea but that's what it says multiplayer mode for free uh, play so again we can just experience the routes and try the routes but we can try them out together additional bus line 100 and 200 with various routes two new bus variants i don't know whether they're going to be scania i've got no idea I've got no idea whether it's only going to be Scania in this game or whether they're going to bring different brands but we have got two new bus variants coming in phase two AI buses so as you've seen at the moment there's plenty of AI plenty but there's no AI buses that is coming in phase two we've got some depots coming as well and if you are looking for it full controller support phase three which is basically the end of early access and this is where it gets interesting and this might be where you just want to wait and you go okay i like the look of it but i'm just going to wait i don't want to get involved in yet another early access game i'll wait until it's out this is what's going to happen in phase three uh, we're going to get the game basically which is create your own bus company buy vehicles and hire staff maintain and repair the vehicles of your fleet and generate income via ticket sales so that basically is bus sim 21 it's what we're used to but you're not going to be able to do that until the very very end of early access and when it's released multiplayer mode for economy so whereas phase two we've got multiplayer mode for free play which we're doing now in phase three we've got multiplayer mode for economy so we can both possibly earn money or you can come and help me earn money with my bus company um, additional bus line 245 with various routes the final bus variant the fact it's saying variant um, is making me think there's just Scania in this game but we'll have to see I'm excited about this one AI trams uh, you know you're gonna have to give way for trams uh, I think that's gonna be really cool um, announcements and NPC audio dialogues 
Is this the one with your voice? No, that's Bus Sim 21. Um, yeah, the Bus Sim 21. Open hub, free roaming area between Berlin Central Station and Potsdamer Platz. That's perfect pronunciation. Including the Tiergarten Tunnel. Complete tutorial and checklist. So that's basically what you're buying into. That's what you're going to get. That's the three different phases. Um so yeah, I'll tell you what we'll do. Let's go back now. So we've seen we've seen the articulated. Let's go and get a normal size bus uh, and do some weather as well. I'm just going to go and get a drink. My throat is really, really dry. Two seconds, everyone. Reese, thank you very much. I appreciate that. I'm just going to get a drink from the fridge. Two seconds. <laughs> At least he had pants on. Not like last time. <laughs> so yeah, I've shown you that. Let me show you some other stuff now as well. Right, let's change buses. So rather than the Scania citywide 18 meter, we're going to go to the 12 meter. And we had this, um, we had this um, sort of situation with Bus Sim 21, didn't we? Where in a way, the uh, <laughs> first time for everything. In a way, the Bendy bus is actually easier to drive than just the single variant. Like this one, that's 18 meters, the Bendy bus split in two. This is 12 meters, just one unit. So this will probably be harder um, to put round. Um, line and tour. So let's go to another one here. And what we'll do is let's go, let's go full summer, but we're gonna go in the rain as well. And we're gonna go towards the evening. Let's go sort of five o'clock, something like that. There you go. Weather, let's have precipitation, which means rain. Can we see the map and how it uh, how it looks like? Yeah, you can. I think it only shows you the route. Though. It doesn't show you the whole thing, but yeah, of course. Okay, so here we've got a bit of rain and it doesn't actually affect performance either. Um, you sisters, you two. <laughs> Hello, love. All right. Um, yeah, you can see the rain on the windscreen as well. Actually looks all right. Let's get in. So we're um, we're late evening, basically, in the summer. But um, we, we've got a bit of a summer storm going on. Yeah, please behave yourself in chat. We're just chilling out here. It's all good. It's all good. Right, okay. So the first thing to do, um, because it's very easy to drive off, and I did this earlier. Um, yeah, you can change your seat. Yeah, you can do all of that. Um, I, I did this earlier. I was driving around the route, and it still allows you to, um, uh, to drive around the route, but no one was getting on the bus. I'm like, why is no one getting on? You have to actually start the route. So you click start, and for some reason, you have to put in the tour number. So 59309 press enter and you can see the AI reacts and you know they can they come over and they start getting on the bus there you go you press number nine is standard to um, go over to uh, to the ticket machine he wants a single ticket ABC so there's three different routes that you can buy um, there you go Pr it prints the ticket oh hang on uh, amount oh one I like the way it prints the ticket. I wish that you saw them just reach up for it. That would be very, very good. <laughs> a vest in rainy weather. Yeah, but it's the summer, isn't it? We just got caught out. I like the way you have to actually take the money as well. Give him the change. It doesn't tell you how much change to uh, give either, which I like. Helps me with me maths. <laughs> yeah, it's cool. It is cool. But don't forget, early access. We always have to make that clear. There we go. All right, let's get going. Can you disable tickets? Um, no, I don't think so, but why would you want to? That, you know, it's a bus game, why would you want to? 
but there are different this isn't just like the one variation of, of rain you can have rain at night rain in the summer uh, rain during the day rain in the afternoon this is just one of them we've got a few um, we've got a few lights going on as well I haven't I've just remembered actually I've just thought to myself I haven't actually tried this game at night so that's going to be a first for all of us but you do need a mouse yes you do really yeah the stream is blurry uh, maybe um, refresh or is it blurry for anyone else yeah I think so Wilkins and you know people are saying that um, firm bus I've never played firm bus um, and they're saying that firm bus is buggy as hell but I mean you can see what I'm playing we're not really encountering any major issues um, he's not allowed it oh okay yeah cross our fingers um, uh, warrior absolutely yeah, just um, just refresh it or put the uh, quality settings up. Does this support the seat mover? No. <laughs> I do like in bus sim that they have um, they react running along, covering their head up, um, and uh, with umbrellas. I do like that. Right, let's open up the doors. What's the little computer in your window to the left? Um, what the game or? behind me that's an arcade machine if that's what you're asking that's all right David I mean people you know people come in and out the stream don't worry let me deal with that and the mods is fine I'll put the pinned message and every now and again we'll say it don't please don't get um, no one needs to get frustrated about people asking they're entitled to ask aren't they they're coming into the stream of course they're gonna ask it's when they ask over and over again that's a different thing altogether Mars thank you very much mate I appreciate that thank you that is very generous of you no, he means in the bus. Um, let's have a look. Oh, what, this thing here? Hmm, I don't know what that is. I don't know whether that's some kind of... Whether that's some kind of taco. I don't know what that is, to be honest with you. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah, exactly, Golden. No, it's, it's fine. You can ask. I mean, there is a pin message. You might not see it. Um, not everyone um, bothers about pin messages. So it's totally fine. We've got patience. It's all good. Yeah, we ain't got patience for that, and that's fine. That, that, the, the mods will deal with that. It's a driver taco. Yeah, yeah, I thought so, yeah. Can you put on the left mirror? Um, do we want the left mirror? I mean, we've got that there, haven't we? We don't really want... I mean, we can try it. Let's have a look. We can put that on there. That's not a problem. Yeah, I mean, you've got it. I think it's a tracker, yeah, it probably is, yeah, yeah. Yeah, no, I, I can't confirm that it's a taco. It's got to be something to do with that, yeah. Yeah, the game's good, um, Ziva. I, I enjoy it, I like it. Just know that it's not bare bones in terms of what you're getting because, you know, the graphical model, I think, is already there. I think it's already looking lovely. Early access, of course, because it's early access, you are getting quite a bare bones game. There's not really a game as such. You're you're pretty much demoing all the routes, and there are a lot of routes, and you can do it with two buses, and you can do it in any weather or time of day you choose. So there is enough to keep you busy, but there's no sort of um, progression or anything like that. That's going to come in phase three or when the game actually um, completes. I've just remembered. Yeah, we're not in the bendy bus. Okay, so we've got um, we've got just a long bus. <laughs> yeah, I think the rain looks cool. Yeah. That's alright, transport. All good. No more foggy mirrors. Yeah, well, we'll judge that when it's out, won't we? I like these uh, overhead cables as well. You know, there's a, there's, a, there's a lot of detail going on. Also, have you noticed how we can see through the AI vehicles I mean that's that's a first isn't it normally they've got like a you know just like a reflective you can't really see through I quite like that you can actually see through the van and see what's going on um, up ahead so that's cool yeah definitely AC yeah you know you're totally right yeah totally right I must say though, like I said before, I am quite taken with the graphics and the way it looks and the location. I like Ger well, I love Germany. I'd love to go to Germany, and um, I think it's done really well. And can you imagine? It's a bit like Train Sim when I experience the Southeastern Line, which is my local line. It puts a totally different spin. Imagine if this was London. Now, 
okay, not for everyone, but I know London. You know, imagine going around Trafalgar Square and all that and just thinking, wow, that looks... It. People that love or know Germany are going to be having that same sort of experience, if you like. And uh, I think it's cool. Even if I, even if you don't know Germany, I still think that um, it's cool. <laughs> I, like, I might start driving like that. <laughs> yeah, I might start driving like that. Yeah, I'd love to go to Germany, yeah. Yeah, there you go. She, if she can do it, that's how I'm going to do it. There you go. <laughs> think, it about, uh, think that uh, about covers the cost. Yeah, well, that's what early access is, isn't it? You know, you are buying into the game early, so it should be cheaper. How big is the map, uh, and how many buses can you drive? Well, there's only two buses in the game so far, because it is early access. Um, no, it's not clipping, John. That's how I'm going to, you know. <laughs> um, the map is eventually going to be a one-to-one -one representation of Germany. Now, I don't know if you can just um, go free play and just drive around and do whatever you want. Obviously, that's going to be broken down into routes, isn't it? But the whole of Berlin is going to be there. Yeah, did I say Germany? Sorry, not Germany. Not the whole of Germany. The whole of Berlin is going to be there. Oh, actually, as well, let me pull over, because I think you can do something, actually. I think. I'm not sure, but I think you can change it on the fly. I think. Um, let's go sunny. Yeah, I think you can, actually. Yeah, yeah, you can just change it on the fly, which I think is really cool, actually. Um, you can't try change the time of day. But that's fine. We can do that. Right, we've got a bit of a storm. I'm meant to be over there in that lane, actually. Oh, okay, Hurricane. Yeah, okay. Can you drive in front of something to test the AI? Yeah, yeah, we'll do that. I mean, they all do seem to be pretty good. Like, they're not trying to... It's a totally different league to on the road. Let me just tell you that now. Totally different league. Um, the snow, we have to move it forward to winter for the snow. You don't need to check for passengers, no. Yeah. Now this is meant to be a storm. Oh, let's have a look. Oh, just pushing in a little bit. But yeah, this is a totally different league, really. As I've, uh, you don't even need me to tell you that, do you? False feedback. There's not much going on. False feedback. Not really. I don't know whether they're. Um, yeah, the windscreen wipers are on. Well, they, at least they should be. I've got it automatic, so it should be. Oh god, I haven't even set a button. I haven't even set a button. <laughs> right, let's go over here. Right, so we wanna we wanna go in front of people, don't we? I mean, they need to have a word, don't they? They need to have a word. That's all you want from AI, isn't it? You know, you don't want to, you don't want them to get out and start having bloody conversations with you. You just want them to act similar to real life. That's all you want. That is all you want. Let's go dynamic. Yeah, I don't know why the wipers aren't working because they're set to automatic. Even that's quite a cool effect, though. <laughs> There's no plans for console at the moment. Yeah, no plans for console, but I mean, never say never, but I've asked, and it says, um, no. Yeah, I think it looks cool, yeah, yeah. I think you can see now that, you know, they, they would have to turn so much stuff off to get this running on particularly the Xbox standard and the PlayStation 4 standard. You know, you're only gonna, you're only gonna have unhappy customers. Let's go back and do another route. I want to show you as much as I can. Press W. Oh yeah, for wipers. Yeah, yeah, probably. Yeah. <laughs> right. Let's um, let's take that out again. Let's move it to winter. All right. Okay. So let's go December. Let's go Christmas Eve. Let's go Christmas Eve in the afternoon. Everyone's out shopping. Last minute shopping. Oh shit! Better get the wife something. Um, right. Let's go here. Um, weather. Um, Precipitation precipitation but that'll be snow so we'll have that let's see what this looks like so do you earn money or rep yeah okay so i'll sh i will t i'll go through the early access um settings in a minute go uh golden oh cool 
<laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> it's it's snowing pixels. <laughs> uh, right, okay. That's cool. Well, they tried. They tried. Okay, brilliant. <laughs> right, okay. <laughs> three, seven, three, two, three. Right, okay, so we've got a single ticket, uh, one of those. <laughs> yeah, the snow's probably got to be worked on. It's fine. Uh, oh, options. Hang on. Uh, ABC. Gotcha. Take the money. Give the change back. A for effort, yeah. <laughs> probably his placeholder. Yeah, it probably is. I mean, that actually looks all right. But, um, yeah. Let's see if we can change that. Uh fog and precipitation it does change quite nicely i like the way it does it on the fly that's got you know that's the beauty isn't it of unreal engine can you imagine expecting unity to do something like this not 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 a chance not a chance not a chance not a big fan of that particular setting but it might be placeholder yeah Front one. There you go. Oh, let's um before we do that, let's show you having a walk around actually. There you go. So we can walk around. And you can walk around the whole city as well. I mean, you know, it's total freedom. Total freedom. Apart from this bit, which obviously is cut off. Let's have a look at the map, actually. Where, where are we? <laughs> so this gives you an idea of what's going to come, but I think the main route exists on this line, um, and all the different all the different routes are part of this line, and that's where, in the early access, we're going to get new lines put in. A romantic scene in a film set in New York. Not my favourite um, setting, I'll be honest. Um, so I'll probably reset this. I think what we need to do is we need to try um, some night time. I want to see the lights on the buildings. Yeah, I don't like the snow, but that's fine. They've done well up till now, haven't they? Right, free play. Let's go... Let's just go June, but we're going to go at night as well. Yeah, it looks like you've got to keep clicking there. There's no quick way. There you go. That'll be fine. Uh, we'll just go dynamic. That's totally fine. Yeah, no console on this one. Yeah. No winter of passion. <laughs> 28th, please! <laughs> No, I don't bloody want snow. No, no. No, 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 no. How'd you get the mirrors up? Type in the chat, somebody. Pre press um, uh, press tab, and then you can right-click. Control mode. Dynamic. Let's just go sunny, then. Yeah, we don't want that snow. I mean, it's July, isn't it? We set it to July. That's better. That's what we want to see. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, that looks nice. Oh, nice. I haven't actually tried this yet at night. Oh, cool, cool, cool. I think I've set the bus lights to be manual. I wonder whether we've got to start the bus, you know, start the route by going to the machine because they're waiting for, they're waiting basically um, for me to set this up. I wonder whether the bus lights actually go on once we start. That will be interesting. 27240, click that. Now they're going to come on. No, there's no lights, is there? I might have to do that manually then. Hello, gorgeous, how are you? You're out, you're out late, what are you up to? 
Um, a, B, and one of them. There's a ticket. There you go. For try and have the ne the right change next time, sweetheart. Please. There you go. Go on. Off you go. Yeah, if you press tab and then you just um, you can turn them on or off by pressing uh, right click. Thank you very much, Mars, for that. Right. Uh, yeah. So. Um, hmm. Okay. Let's have, let's have a look. Let's try and work that out. Um, controls. Uh, no, that's not what we want actually. It might be okay. No, the reason I say no is um, we can do that here. <laughs> hazard lights, <laughs> David. You got a thing about hazard lights, didn't you? <laughs> right, control mode. Okay, Autom uh, automated lights. Okay, this will start the vehicle and sit down. Okay, that should work. That should be on. Um, so these are the sort of things that you can do as well. Automated engine, I've um, I've just left that on. Gear switching, so <laughs> actually if I, to contradict myself, if you put your foot on reverse, it will uh, on on brake, it will reverse, but not nowhere near as quick or annoying as on the road. So I've just left that. Automated lights, automated wipers. I'll do the doors myself, right? I'll do that. I'll do that. Um, automated air conditioning, automated clearance, and start directly from the bus stop. So um, that should work. Yeah, it should work. I don't know why the lights aren't coming on. <laughs> She's off down the Reaper Bond. I don't know what that is. Yeah, I'm quite impressed with this at night actually, and performance doesn't seem to be suffering. It's all, it's all as it was. It's all running exactly the same. Berlin looks absolutely lovely. It looks like a proper romantic um, city, doesn't it? Yeah, I like this. This is cool. The Brandenburg Gate in yet? Yeah, I'm not sure, Hans. Yeah. If you don't start directly from the start, we're probably just down the road, like bus sim. Yeah, probably just down the road. Okay, let's, um, oh, there is snow on the ground. It, what? Let's just go back. We're just having a good look around the game, so don't get frustrated with me going back. We're just, we're just looking around it. Um, free play, uh, line. Oh, we're still in December, that's why. Yeah, we're still in December. So, oh, I didn't choose an actual date. Right, now. Okay, that's fine. Now we'll be fine. Yeah, early access, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I bet, Matt. No console. No console. It's not planned for console in any way. None of their other stuff has come to console, like Fernbus. The same developer as Fernbus. And t Where's me night time? Oh, for goodness sake. I want night time. The best bus depot is on the roadmap for Phase 2. Yeah, I shall show you um, in a second, actually. Um, that's... Fine, okay. It was half eight. Okay, but let's go to... Let's go to March and go at night time. That's got to be dark, isn't it? No, that's fine, Carl. Well, you know, if, I, if, I'm, if I can be patient, so can you as well. Not everyone's coming in and uh, asking at the same time and listening to the same answer. <laughs> Don't start your whinging. I bloody well will. Oh, that's quite nice. That's like a... Yeah, I quite like the dynamic side of it. So we've still got lights on. We will go a little bit um, later on our next run. Let's get this run done. So, 7.06.92. you got to do this for them to... Um, for the bus to be in service, basically. Yeah, it's weird though because um, there. So that's for the doors. So you can do the doors um, from there as well. And you've got that one. Then you've got this one here, but it says not available in this mode. So what I need to do. Right. Bear with me because we're working it out. We're having a look around the game. That's what it's all about. Let's go back to the main menu. And we will go here. Control mode. Uh, control mode. Automated lights off. All right. So let's do that. We've got to do it ourselves. 
This is one I have a wheelchair ramp. No, it doesn't, Kiwi. Not that I can see, anyway. What did you have for dinner, Kaleem? Okay, that's cool. So we're going to have to do our own lights now, but that's not a problem. We will eventually have it all manual, so you've got to do everything. That's, that's, the, that's the fun, isn't it? So, there you go. So we should be able to do this now. So fog light... Turn off lighting. Oh, here we go. Turn on lighting. Oh, lovely. Oh, gorgeous. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's let's have a bit of that. Oh, now we're cooking, aren't we? Oh, look at the lighting. Right, okay. Again, bear with me. What we're going to do is we're going to go back and we're going to put it much later and have a proper drive round in the evening. We getting some snow runner? Maybe, Peter. You you never know. I've got a good indie game for you in the morning. I'm not going to tell you what it is. I'm not going to tell you. It's I, I've only, I've played it for about ten minutes, and I was like, oh oh yes, yeah, this is going to be good. Yeah, so um, yeah, ten o'clock tomorrow, I think, maybe later. Um, yes, Bosch. Chicken and mash, chicken and mash, chicken and mash to nine. Will you drive to Teagle Airport in this stream? Uh, pro is the airport even in the game yet, Sim? <laughs> More bloody secrets. <laughs> Look out for the game, because I'll tell you what, I think I'm going to be playing it quite a lot. Who parked there? Okay, so now we can do our own lights, right? Here we oh, you can't bloody see, though. Turn on that. Nice. Uh, turn off. To, well, what, what, not, what, what do you mean? Not, what, what, what about the lights? What about... Where's the actual lights, though? Are they here? Turn off lighting for bus stops? Oh, my God. You've got hatches and every... Open front of hatch. Oh, look at... Oh, my God. Look at that. Open middle hat. What? Open what? Oh my god! Look at this. Oh, I like that. <laughs> That's good. I like that. Uh, where's me bloody headlights though? That's what I'm worried about. Switch camera. Look at this. Look. You can what? <laughs> the lights are next. To There's quite a bit you can do. It's cool, isn't it? It's cool. <laughs> Sorry, I'm getting all excited now. Right. Hazards, you say? Hazards. <laughs> oh, they're down here. Oh, okay, switch. Oh, that was yeah. Okay, switch the lights. It's not working. Switch the lights. It's not working. That's a shame. What's going on? What's going on? I want to. Um, da -da -da, no, you can't really do that. Oh, hang on. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Right, you have to drag it over. I got gotcha, you. I got gotcha. you. Right, so we want it on that one. Let's go outside. Have we got lights? Yes, we have. We've also got hazard lights for David. David, we've got hazard hazard lights. All right. It's going to be available on the twenty fifth. So yeah, we're just playing with the game, really. Yeah. Yeah, twenty fifth. Right, okay, so we're, we're, we're pretty sorted now. We're pretty sorted. Let's go back there. Um, did we turn the lighting on? That's it. Oh, lovely. Oh, beautiful. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Oh, yeah, look look at this. This is good. Right, okay, let's, um, let's actually get on with some bus driving. Now we've been messing about with the game. 1790. Oh, 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 God. One seven, <laughs> one seven nine, oh one. The bus is active. You can see the hazard lights. Well, there you go. That's just for you, David. Although I am turning them off now. No, I want the bloody. I want the lights, though. Yeah, that's what I want. Lovely. Right, we've got our first customer of the evening. They want a single ticket. We want A, B, and one M. Ticket comes out, and we want to give 
There you go. Lovely. How are you, Snowy? Passengers look just like Fernbush. Yeah, I'm sure they're put straight over, Stephen, but, you know, maybe that'll change. Maybe it won't. I don't know. I mean, look at it. Oh, come on. You know, look at this detail. It's pretty, pretty sweet, isn't it? Come on. Who likes that amount of detail? Considering that's not like a, a scripted, that was just, it just so happens that I moved the camera there. What do you think of that detail? Because, uh, yeah, that's pretty, pretty good detail, isn't it? Yeah, I want to know what you think. <laughs> Will this be coming to Game Boy Color? It's all, it, this is the Game Boy uh, Color port. Live music on piano. See, I can I can translate German. Yeah, that's pretty good though, isn't it? Yeah, happy with that. Right, let's close. Let's go. Oh, hang on. What door haven't I shut? The front one. Okay, I can do that. Can't you tell them you can't change the tenor? <laughs> right, let's go and actually do some driving at night because uh, the environment is actually quite exciting, me. I like the way it looks, I really do. Yeah, I really do. And I think you can genuinely see why it wouldn't come to console. It's very, very dense detail. Um, there's quite a bit going on. I'm not sure I like the way the lights um, are coming on as we drive nearer, but that's fine. There's optimization still to come. Can you please stop changing your intro music? This intro music is better because it should... Uh, I'll put what bloody intro music I like, David, to be honest with you. Alright, just chill out. Put bloody what... I'll put on what I bloody want, David. <laughs> there we go. Middle, uh, front, middle and back door. Yeah, this looks really cool. Oh, we've got a ticket customer. There we go. Press number nine. Um, they want a single ticket. ABC. 380. And there you go. Hello, sweetheart. Um, ticket AB Bosch. You can actually see the headlights working. Yeah, yeah, exactly, Mick. How are you? The thing I hated about busing, mate, in is that um, as soon as you fell behind the schedule, you really fell behind. How is the scheduling? Well, Speedy, this is early access, so at the moment in phase one, um, you're just driving. You're just driving. That part of it isn't in the game. This is early access, uh, and like true early access, you get a cut-down version of the game, don't you? They've got three phases planned. I will go through very soon, um, again, for those that have just come in. But yeah, at the moment, all you can do is drive two buses around various routes... Um, at any time of night and day and any weather as well right okay uh, yeah, oh, oh here we go that's it you want one euro oh, oh, oh maybe she didn't okay Aerosoft uh, and early access they don't mix well uh, your boy your, your faults are your faults um, what I would say in this is that's why I like to show you stuff I think this is um, actually working alright yeah Yeah, they do, um, uh, Coffin. Yeah, yeah, I like that as well. I did notice that. I'm not here to... I always try and put this across. I'm not here to sell the game. I'm not here to... On behalf of Aerosoft. I'm not here to defend the game. I'm just here to show it to you. It's as simple as that. Uh, we can talk about the things we like, the things we don't like. I'm just here to show it. You know, I'm, I've got no agenda. I'm not paid to... Um, pay to show it. Oh. Oh, that's happening. Okay. <laughs> Maybe sim, but um, I did ask and it was a no. You know, so yeah. The texture isn't loading in on that truck um, in front. I like the way you've got CCTV cameras there as well. Oh, you got one behind. How's it doing that? That's why. How's it doing that one? Oh, what's she up to? Yeah, selling itself. Yeah, that's. Uh, I, li I like a game that can. Oh, I, I'm just going through a red light, actually. Yeah, I'm going through a red light. It's all good. Oh, look at the moon there. Oh, this is really pretty, actually. Oh, God, that looks really nice. Wow. 
Okay, that's um, that's interesting. The graphically, this is done really, really well. Look at the old diesel fumes coming out there as well. That's um, <laughs> she looks really good. Yeah, it does look awesome. Yeah, it's going to be twenty-one pound. Yeah. <laughs> this is a good starting point, yeah. Oh, green light, here we go. Of course it looks better than on the road. Anybody would tell you that. Yeah, any anyone would tell you this looks better than on the road. It's a totally different league, isn't it? You know, this is... Um, these are obviously um, professional craftsmen and artists to um, create something like this. Hang on, that's no moon! <laughs> yeah, these are in a different league. It doesn't mean that we don't support on the road. It just means that we can talk about it in a realistic fashion. These are clearly um, a different league. It's as simple as that. Yes, it was Sim. <laughs> yeah, you might be better off with this madman. Yeah, yeah, you might be. It is a good-looking game. Yeah. Oh, I've got, I've got customers. Customers, everyone. Right. Okay. So we've got single A B ticket. Single A B. I like the way the little ticket goes up. That's great. I wish you saw their arm pick it up. Um, the price is three pound. You have to click on their money. So they want one euro change. Nice one. Hello, G uh, lady. Sorry. Uh, AB. Same ticket. There you go. Yeah, I like the way the light comes on. And then when you shut the door, it goes off. I really like that. There's Hang on. There's... He's in. He's half in and up. That's dangerous. That's dangerous, mate. What are you doing? What are you doing? What? Why are you doing that? Come on, get out. <laughs> oh, is it really artful? Oh, okay. <laughs> right, away we go. Yeah, so the, I think the beauty of this game, when it's finished, is the fact that there's going to be, surely, so many routes. If they're going to model the whole of Berlin as a city, you know, you're, you're going to be struggling to be doing the same route over and over again. Um, yeah, I think the selling point is the graphics and the fact that it's going to be a one-to-one -one representation of um, a Berlin. But, I mean, you only have to look here. You don't even need me to tell you. You only have to look here and go, wow, this <laughs> this actually looks really good. And it does. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What was that? Oh, I've got my own bus lane and I'm not even in it. Look. <laughs> right, put an indicator on. An embarrassed indicator, that one will be. Yeah, sharing the drive-in. Yeah, you can do that. Let's, um, just for those that have just come in, well, well, actually, I'll ask you, does anyone want to see the early access, um, free phases, what you get? If you, if you've already seen it, that's fine. Um, if you've just come in, uh, I can tell you exactly what you're going to get in early access and the two, um, phases. Oh, really, Scarab? Yeah, I do fancy going, yeah. Yeah, all of Germany, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hello, Spud, how are you? Let's just very, very quickly go through this then. I don't even need to show you um, sort of phase one, do I? Because we're playing uh, phase one. So phase one, you get all the bits that we've seen. Phase two, so if you're going to buy into this game, and there's no date um, with phase two, but the next phase two, I was told that early access is going to go from 12 to 16 months. It sounds very specific, but you've got um, probably about a year and a bit to wait until you get the full um uh, final game but phase two whenever the next one comes you're going to get um modding so i don't know whether that means that you know mods will open and you can start downloading other people's mods or whether um you can just make your own mods i've got no idea but that's going to be there multiplayer mode so with this this um this free this free play will still be here in phase two but you can invite friends in to come and drive with you. Additional bus line 100 and 200 various routes. So it's going to open up lots more routes. Two more bus variants. The fact that they're using the word variants tells me that it's probably going to be more scanniers. AI buses. So you may or may not have noticed that there's no other AI buses on the road. So that's going to come in phase two. We're going to get some depots as well. Everyone loves a bus depot. 
and full controller support phase three now this is really the one that that we want and it might be the one that you sort of wait for you might think well okay this game looks good but do i want yet another early access game if that's your trail of fault you might just want to wait until either phase three or actual uh, retail release and you're going to get the proper game that we're going to want to play create your own bus company buy vehicles and hire staff maintain and repair the vehicles of your fleet generate income via ticket sales so all of this is not in the game at the moment multiplayer mode for economy so we can get people in and help us earn money as well more lines more buses ai trams that's going to be cool and it's going to give it that real sort of um european feel isn't it announcements obviously I know that I think the bus has actually got announcements, but we're going to have more announcements and NPC audio uh, dialogues. We're going to get free roaming and some tutorials as well. Um, so, yeah, that's that's what you're going to basically be getting. This is what you're going to get if you do want to um, invest in it on the 25th. I don't particularly recommend getting in the early access of this i mean if you like what you see and you're after another bus well you're golden it's it's there but if you you know if you want another bus game you just be aware that there's nothing to do as such in the early access there's only just testing the routes you can just go on the route yes you can collect tickets but there's no point behind it you're not going to earn any money um, which might bore you it might frustrate you but at least if I'm telling you then you know don't you there you go Bosh the phase you want to wait for um, or you want to get excited over is phase 3 where we actually get the game yeah I'll wait until it's out of early access. Yeah, a lot of people will, yeah. It's not got your voiceover, though, is it, Jay? It's probably up for Bus Sim 2021. Unless they ask me, they get off. They might ask me, you never know. Hello, Catface, how are you? Right, we're going to stay in our bus lane. I think nighttime looks fantastic. It's cool. You know me, I'm not, I'm not necessarily a graphics whore. I'm not a whore of any sort. But if I am going to be a whore... It's a detail haul. I love detail. And there's there's so much depth of detail going on in this game. You know, you look down the street and there's just there's just a lot of depth behind it. And uh, it looks nice at night, I must say. And again, if this is your first uh, bus sim, just be aware that you, you know, you're going to be stopping every every five ten minutes because obviously that's the job of a bus driver isn't it is this going to be multiplayer yeah did you just was you in have you only just come in Liam any reason I ask is I've just gone through that look at the moon what is it kingy boy What's the computer in the window? I think it's some kind of tracker or taco. I don't exactly know what it is. I will find out actually for the um, for for the next video. They do clearly let anyone, yeah. Visage? Never heard of it. Hello Jaffa, how are you? And thank you for all coming in and spending some of your um, cheeky Sunday evening with me. I don't normally stream on a Sunday, but um, the embargo lifted for me today. So I thought I'd come on and just show you um, and give you an idea of it's coming out next Thursday on the 25th. It's going to be um, it's going to be about £21, €25. Euros. And um, yeah, it's got them three phases which we just spoke about. Can you drive the articulated? Yeah, yeah, we'll do another route after this. I think I've pretty much shown you all of it, really. Um, yeah, there's the Steam um, link, or it's in the description as well. Yeah, no plans for console. But the AI actually seem to be behaving. We haven't really um, encountered any issues with AI. In fact, Let's be honest, we haven't really encountered any issues at all. Um, I, I feel very positive about this. I do actually really like it. And you know I love a bus sim. You, you, know, you know I love a bus sim. I do like it. And it's got that sort of... Um, 
I like the the realism look. It, it, they've gone for pure sort of trying to make it look as real as possible. Where Bus Sim um, 18, they they went for, and I don't know whether you agree with me. They have gone for a, a real look, but it, it's also it's almost it's just like a take on 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 on, uh, on real life. It's almost got a little cartoony um, slight edge to it. Whereas this. I think they're just trying to make it look as real as possible and I think for the most part they are actually succeeding. That looks cold. Whoa! That's not cool. Yeah. Seemed a bit uh, condensed little arcade. Yeah, which is fine. That's their market. It's not a problem. It's coming out on console and it probably suits that. Maybe these are going for the more simulator aspect. I mean, come on. We actually undid the vents. We undid the vents on the top of the bus. What? What? I didn't know it did that. We'll do it again in a minute. That was really cool. Police in front. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's, uh, let's go easy. It's got a nice look left and right system as well. Which seems to work lovely. Yeah, exactly, Speedy. I think you've got it right, actually. Yeah, it seems right smack in the middle of Omsme. Uh, and bust him. Yeah, absolutely right. Yeah, yeah. Uh, what do you mean, what made me play it, Joseph? I'm here to cover new games, and um, I've got it early, and it's coming out next week. And it's um, it's on point, as they like to say, isn't it, Scarab? It's on point for the chat uh, for the channel. Um, so yeah, that's, that's that's why. It's absolutely on point. <laughs> There's a lot to look at, isn't there? There's, there's, there is actually a lot to look at. It's cool. He's got a bu bus fetish. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing wrong with bus sim. You know I love bus sim. Uh, you know, I do like it. Are there any double-deckers available? No, Darren, not at the moment, no. Oh, I think you can do you can do air, air conditioning here, um, Speedy. I've put that on manual, but yes, you can do that here. Yeah, absolutely. Are we in the... Uh, yeah, we're in the standard, aren't we? I, I forgot for a second whether we was in the articulated or the standard. Not coming out on console. I like the way we can actually see in the cars. Again, in bus sim, for obvious reasons, um, performance related, I imagine, through, through to the... Um, the console port. They've all got sort of blacked out or, or mirrored um, windows, haven't they? Here, you can actually see inside the cars. <laughs> don't be, don't be sneaky. <laughs> Brilliant. Brilliant. <coughs> I love a private joke. <laughs> right, let's open the doors. <laughs> You said your voice is going to be in the game. Not this game, Jaffa. Let's bust him. Yeah, the lighting is lovely. I mean, and it's almost like it's got um, got like a photo mode built in, which obviously it hasn't. But it's sort of like any position you put it, it sort of looks good, doesn't it? Yeah, I'm, I feel really positive about the game. Uh, but most importantly, it's... Um, it's running correctly, isn't it? And it doesn't look janky. It all looks good. If this is their starting point, their end point will be um, will be interesting. Yeah, the growth in the pathways. Yeah, uh, you know, someone someone likes designing cities. Put it that way. It, they've um, and because it's PC, the draw distance look not, looks nice down there, doesn't it? Obviously, if they was going to port it to console, which they're not, but if they was going to try it, you know, it, they would have to cut out so much, wouldn't they? That's what we need, Peter. Yeah, and it needs someone to, to do it. Yeah. Yeah, it's from Firm Bus Developer, yeah. Yeah, and um, Tourist Bus as well. Hello, Dave. How are you? I think it is moggy, yeah, I mean, you can see from the, the sat-nav and the, the bus stops themselves, yeah. <laughs> Definitely, Mav-man. 
<laughs> like I say, and that wasn't being horrible to the developers of On The Road, but you can see that these are an entirely different level. You know, you can just see that. Oh, look at that! You can see in there! That's so cool! <laughs> I think when the air conditioning goes, you can actually see all them fans moving as well. Yeah, this is... Um, it's, a, it's a different league, isn't it? And that's not being horrible, that's what's called being realistic. Yeah, you're right, Peter. Yeah. Oh, well, there you go, Moggy. Yeah, th this might interest you. Like I say, I'm never here to sell anyone a game. I'm here to show game. That's it. That's that's where my job finishes. But, you know, it's nice to let people know that stuff's coming out. It's all good. I like Tourist Bus. Yeah, I played it on the channel, actually. Whoa. Thank you, Artful. Are these not the same devs as on the road? No, Ma. Same publisher. Yeah. Yeah, I like that, but they've all got this breathing thing that a lot of these games have. You know, where they sit there, like they're angry, <laughs> like they're just ready for an outburst. I mean, you don't sit there like this, do you? But I suppose they've got to exaggerate it, you know, because most people would just sit there like that, wouldn't they? Isn't Aerosoft the one that makes Microsoft like... No, no, that's Microsoft. <laughs> Funnily enough, um, but yeah, they do make stuff for Microsoft uh, Flight Sim. Have you heard anything about Bus Sim 21? Um, what, what do you mean, have I heard anything? No, I, I don't know the release date, if that's what you're asking. What's up, Pete? What's up, Max? What's uh, And all suffering with anxiety. Yeah? <laughs> I hate this bus driver. I like the way also as well. Like, like we've got the looking left and right already built in. That's cool. But say we leave it down here, just um, focused on the steering wheel. As we accelerate away, it just resets, and you can change that position um, as well. And again, to have little bits like that in early access, um, it's quite exciting. This feels like a refreshing early access um, release. Do you agree? You know, what are you looking for, Max? Yeah, they make add-ons, yeah. It might be my drive-in, yeah. Love the uh, smoke coming out there as well. No PS4. No no console. But Aerosoft are just a publisher, so they deal with... Um, throat before no... What's happened, Max? What's up, son? Oh, you're doing a test. Oh, okay. He's looking for his COVID test. Okay. Track IR? It is already track IR compatible. Yes. Oh, you have to do the throat first. I'm sure you know this, don't you, Max? You know me. I always like going to um, the exterior, don't I? But yeah, I think the lighting's pretty cool. Check this out though, right? <laughs> Just in case you haven't seen it. Oh god, I'm going to get all, all excited here. Look, look, you can open up... Oh, you can't see it. Oh, you can't see it. Oh, that's a shame. I'll do it when it's more light. But you can open up all these vents. You see these vents here? You can actually open them up. I think that's brilliant. Right. Let's go. Yeah, they should make it more... Yeah, I suppose so, but how many times do you see a, a, a bus getting pulled over by police, you know? A lot of these things... We've, we've had developers in the stream. You know, let's talk about... We had um, the developer for Fire Simulator in our stream. Really good stream, actually, if you want to look for it. What uh, If you just type Fire Simulator... Um, yeah, of course, Madman, yeah. If you type Fire Simulator, we had the... Um, oh, Dad, you missed Gordon. What's happened with Gordon? Sorry, what happened? What happened? Did I miss it? What did I miss? Sorry. Yeah, we had the developer in the stream for a couple of hours just talking about video games and people's requests, you know, and it's got a it's got to work from uh it's got it's gotta be economical, both from uh Oh I don't know oh sorry Gordon, sorry Gordon. 
I was rabbiting away. You know I appreciate that. Yeah, five. The squad, that's it. If you type the squad into the channel, if you are interested in sort of like, you know, like, thank you, Gordon. Uh, love you. If you are interested in sort of behind the scenes, um, we had one of the developers come into the chat and we played the game together. And yeah, it, you know, a request would be, you know, can we have police pull you over? Well, that's a lot of... That's a lot of development time, isn't it, for something that pretty much isn't going to happen. You know, nine times out of ten, if it, if they had to pull you over, you got a ticket, like real life, you just wouldn't speed, would you? And then that, that, that development time would be wasted because uh, uh, you wouldn't be activating it, would you? He put dollar in your panties. <laughs> Fiddling with a roof fence, yeah. So, yeah, there are a lot of... Um, requests that people are like, oh, wouldn't it be good if it did this, or wouldn't it be good? Of course, but look at what they've already done. Can you imagine how much work this would have been to create this? This is, um, I mean, look at it. It looks pretty good, doesn't it? I mean, I'm going to go out on a limb here, right? I'm going to go out on a limb. Are you coming with me? Right? I'm going to go out on a limb and say this is as good... Right, are you ready for this? This is as good if not slightly better in terms of detail, the Neuro Truck. Now, it's all about two-way communication here. Tell me if you think I'm right or if you think I'm absolutely wrong. Tell me if you think I'm wrong or right. I really like the detail in this game. And just, you know, like you had a little post, like a BT type thing of all grass growing around the bottom. You know, tell me what you think. It's not only about what, what I think. <laughs> whoa, 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 hang on. I mean, you know, just, you know, looks better than Euro... I'm going out on the limb here, but I play Euro Truck, so I can say that. No. Oh, there's a good mix here. No. Yeah. You know, there's there's, there's a lot... Oh, my good God. Well, hang on. Hang, the, hang on. I see a train track. Hang on. Let's get out of here. Oh, come on. This is pretty good. 100% looks good, yeah. I mean, look at it, look. Now, I, I don't know at the moment if we've got trains where I don't think so. But, come on, I think this... Um, yeah, tough call. Yeah, definitely, yeah. And don't forget that this is only one city, isn't it, you know? I think the detail is much better. Um, but, of course, this is only one city, isn't it? Euro Truck is a lot more than just Berlin, but... Like I said, I was going out on a limb, and I'm glad you've come with me. <laughs> but I think um, detail-wise, it's very, very impressive. Almost touching on GTA, yeah, yeah. And it's nice, I suppose, for them to think, right, we've only got Berlin to work with. Let's work with Berlin. How, how detailed can we actually make it? Rather than just like, oh, we've got an open-world game. Let's just keep adding until, you know, we can't add no more very sort of picturesque isn't it even like that shot there I know it's quite dark um, but yeah even that shot there is cool let's uh, change the weather let's have some uh, let's have some precipitation oh yeah here we go here we go it's raining it's poor oh hello we've got some customers <laughs> when would it be another F1 stream Tuesday I think yeah Yeah, I don't think that was trams down there, though. That was an actual train station, wasn't it, Artful? Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm right. <laughs> when I said that, though. Whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> whoa, hold on there. Single ABC. I only talk, I only talk as I find, you know? And uh, I must admit, I am enjoying the level of detail in this game and the lighting as well look at the pavement out there yeah I'm pleasantly surprised it's it's really it's really nice and relaxing to just enjoy the game rather than like ah oh, you know let's try and make something out of it you know what I'm on about this is nice just to think wow this is um this is early access this is all good I mean I like the depth of detail it seems to have as well Yeah. Its bus needs more detail. Uh, what, the actual bus, do you think? Okay. It will be on PlayStation. Oh, someone's going uh, <laughs> to... 
Is someone's going to um, screenshot that, Stimson. <laughs> will I play it a lot on the channel? I don't know if I'll play it a lot. I will, I'll, I will certainly keep you informed. And it is the sort of thing where I would come on for a cheeky afternoon stream and just do some um, bus driving. I'm, I'm not going to promise it's going to be here and it's going to become a bus sim channel. But um, I know the people that subscribe to the channel like bus sim. And like I say, it would be the sort of thing that I would tune in on an afternoon and just play, especially as each update comes. Um, oh no, comparing it to ETS, yeah, I got you. I don't know because it's got them three phases. We're obviously already in phase one. I don't know whether they're going to be big updates and you're not going to get anything until the next, or whether it's something they're going to. I will find that out actually, because it would be nice to follow this game and show you as it improves. You know. Barriers on roads, yeah. I think that's because... Well, then barriers won't be there, essentially. They, they shouldn't be there um, because it's going to be a one-to-one -one representation of Berlin. I suppose they're, th they're there at the moment because um, the roads haven't been built. Yeah. I think that's probably why they're there. No, Luke, it's not. Yeah, it should do, Colleen, because it's by the same people. All oh, right, Joshua. Yeah, not much I could do here, mate. I thought the vents. Oh, let's do the vents. We should be able to see now. We've got a bit of light here. Yeah, we've got a bit of light. I love the vents. I think the vents of you had me at vents. Look at this. <laughs> you can actually open them up. I think that's brilliant. Oh, select another hatch. Close the hatch. Select it. <laughs> I love it. Love that. I think that's brilliant. That shows pure detail in the actual vehicle that they're trying to uh, portray, isn't it? Any speed cameras? I haven't. Um, no, Simon. I haven't seen them yet. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, uh, Friday night actually, I think I'm going to do a, an American truck um, stream, get back to channel. Can you open the driver window? Yes, I think you can, um, but I think you've got to set a, a button for it. Uh, let me have a look, I'm sure I saw that. I'm sure I did. So you've got um, toggle air conditioning as well, you can do that. Neil faster. <laughs> Uh, where is it? Look left, look right. I'm sure I saw um, open driver's window. Driver window open. And driver window close. Whoa. Oh, oh, look at this, look. And the sound changes as well, that's nice, of, of course. <laughs> yeah, this is, this is nice. This is progress, isn't it? You know, this is progress. It's not just like, oh, here's another, here's another one. It's like they're trying to move it forward, and I like that. Yeah, I like that a lot. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm buying it. <laughs> so we've got these vents here, haven't we? These vents are open. That would be crazy, wouldn't it? To have them open in... in, in, in this would be crazy, wouldn't it? Let's close them. Let's close them. That wouldn't be fair, would it? Oh, I can't see. Um, oh, I can't see because of the little window. Oh, here we go. Oh, it looks like you can open them... Okay. Maybe it wasn't that one. Maybe it was the other. I think it was the other one we were doing. But I mean, I've never seen that before. Never. Yeah. Does it have an ejector? <laughs> That's a feature on your bus company. Free onboard showers. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Right. Uh, oh, let's open the doors. 
Yeah, we're going to do one in the... Hello, gorgeous. Hello, sweetheart. We're going to do one in the date. In fact, let's go and do it now. Because there's not really a huge amount more to show you. Um, but, uh, yeah. UK stuff. I don't think there will be Liam. This is a German game set. And their ambition is to do a one-to-one -one representation of Berlin. It's not coming to the UK. Yeah, it, this is a, a German game. Okay, let's change the... Um, uh, what have we... Uh, we've pretty much done all sort of states, haven't we? Let's just... Um, Oh, I've got a black screen. Oh, no. Oh, it crashed. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. It's fine. Our first crash, not a problem. Early access, that's going to be happening. Show us the editor. Well, the editor isn't out until phase two. Rough spot. Lots of old Bill. Can you run over pedestrians? Probably not, no. Yeah, <laughs> great idea until you think about it, yeah. Have you done the bendy bus? I have, but we'll go back to that now. You'll see the message, actually. Let me just make sure that that's all capturing okay. Yeah, we've done snow. Right, so we've got this screen. I think you can see it. So, there will be bugs. A lot of bugs. Seriously, lots of bugs. But I don't think there actually has been. That's really the first, um, the first bug we've sort of uh, come across, isn't it? Let's make sure that's capturing. Yes, it is. What uh, that up top uh, left, right, down thing for the next ticket machine on the left of the dashboard? Yeah, I don't know what that is. Some kind of um, it's either like a um, uh, what's it called, a tracker or a taco. I don't really know. What PC do you need to run this optimal? Um, well. The Unreal Engine is getting very, very good now at running on mid-range machines. But obviously, if you wanna, um, if you wanna um, ask Max, uh, ask Mum, Max. Yeah, ask Mum. I can't do much here, can I? Um, yeah, if you wanna put things up, then you have gotta get a better PC. So June, let's go. Let's go for a June summer's day. Will you do a multiplayer stream? Yeah, when it when it's out. Yeah. There aren't bugs. They're features. Yeah, I think it's been. I think it's been pretty good actually. Yeah, well, you know, it's um, we learnt this from Truck Driver, actually. You know, if you want to run pedestrians over, you've got to make your game an 18, and obviously that's going to limit who you can sell it to. So, um, yeah, generally, if you if you go to drive through someone, um, it'll just ghost because then they haven't got to put, um, you know, an 18 sticker on there, you know. New setup. Uh, what For what, Mar Martin? But thank you for coming in tonight. There's been lots of you in. I do appreciate it. We are just going to do the last little route here, I think. So again, a bit like um, on the road. They're using pictures for the shops. But they are they have made the effort to sort of make them have a, a bit of depth to them. Rather than just... Yeah, I mean, I like what they've done there, actually. It actually looks like a shop. Yeah, of course, they're not going to model each individual shop. That would be absolutely ridiculous. But what they have done, they have given a sort of, like, 3D effect, which I appreciate. I quite like that. Yeah, I like I like the fact that the, um, the detail they've gone to there. Like, on the road, they've, they've tried it as well. But obviously they've just put a picture, a low-res picture, for a shop. So these have, um, hello gorgeous, these have done a different job, a different way of doing it. I like that. You can go across the whole the whole place. Apart from when you get under, uh, when you encounter these things, because obviously this, this route hasn't been done yet. But you can wander about everywhere else. <laughs> yeah, get GTA, yeah, exactly, yeah. But even the bike models are <laughs> pretty good, actually. Yeah, just for one single bike model, like, you're not really going to be paying much attention to. Let's be honest, it's just there for decoration, isn't it? Let's try it. Do we get run over? It'll probably go through me. It'll either go through or push me along. Yeah, 
No, they stop. Hello, gorgeous. It's not bad, is it? It's that's all you want. Like I say, you know, I don't expect too much from AI in any game. Actually, all I want them to do is react in a, a semi-real way. This is real, isn't it? They stop. You move out of the way, and they'll carry on. That is all you want. You don't want them to. You don't want them to look like you've broken their brain and they're really struggling to work out what to do next. He knows what to do. He can go now. That that's enough for me. Yeah, that is enough. Now <laughs> they stop in front of you. You can also drive the AI if you push C. Really? Okay. I would. I'll be very surprised if that's true. I'll be over the moon, but I'll be very, very surprised. No, this this ain't GTA. Oh, hello. This ain't GTA, is it? No, it's a bus game. What's my verdict? My verdict, um, I suppose my vi final verdict, because we are going to finish soon, because I think I've shown you everything there is to show. My final verdict is the fact that I'm so pleasantly surprised with the way it runs, most importantly, the way it looks. I think it looks fantastic. Um... Would I recommend jumping on early access? I don't think they're really giving you any reason to really get involved at this at this stage because there's no campaign. You are literally just test driving each route. So there's no progression or anything like that. That's not to say you won't enjoy it because I've enjoyed my time. I recommend waiting for phase three really, which is when the game actually starts you know when you when you've got an economy in it because you want to you want to know that when you're picking people up the money's going somewhere or if you're buying a new bus if you're saving up for something at the moment i mean if you love bus games get on it you're going to love it you're probably going to buy it cheaper than when it gets officially released um i don't think there's any reason to like jump all over it and get stuck into early access maybe keep an eye on it maybe jump jump in and uh, you know get on for 25 quid it's entirely up to you i'm not really one of them ones that will you know oh you've got to buy this or you know that's what the stream's for isn't it to give you an idea whether you fancy um getting involved because like we spoke about the other day it's not so much the 25 quid it's do you want to spend your time in it you know once you spend three or four hours in here you know is, is it worth it you know well to start with you're not going to be able to progress in any way you're only going to be able to experiment with the game um so you'll just be experimenting oh let's try it at night oh, i quite like that route let's do it in the rain let's do it in the rain and storm let's do it in the snow but once you've done that that really is it i think that's not putting the game down uh, in any way that's just being realistic about early access and uh, i think it's important to be realistic do i recommend the game though it's showing a really good sign for uh, being a good gu bus game if that's what you fancy um, oh I had this earlier that it wouldn't it wouldn't move yeah that was I think it's when you get up actually I don't know what the problem like it starts up and we're in drive yeah I had this earlier but we're not it's not going. Not a problem. Let's do let's do one full route. Yeah, see you later, Scott. What is the time anyway? Yeah, I'm gonna do one one route. I'm gonna watch um In the Line of Duty tonight. It's a new series. New series. So uh, we will take the bendy bus. Let's do oh I don't know, let's do this last line maybe. Let's do that. Uh and start there. Yeah, the door sh were shut, yeah. <clears throat> just want to know what else is needed to play this game well you can play it with the keyboard and mouse if you want to um, phase 2 you'll get controller support steering wheel support is in now I'm sure you could get the controller working just through steam anyway right we're actually going to do the full route this what, this time so when you get in the bus um, don't forget you have to start your route by just, just clocking in I think really is what that's doing and then you can see the AI they react the bus is up for business it's all good Shut the doors. I'm just going to see what it's like in 4K, actually. It, it does work okay in 4K. I'll be interested to know if um, 
if it looks or plays any different. It looks a lot crisper, that's for sure. Let me, um, I'll be interested to know what it streams like. That, that would be, oh, we crashed. <laughs> we crashed, that was my fault. <laughs> We're going back in. People playing driving sims with keyboards, yeah, but I suppose it's, it's, it's there, isn't it? You've already got the keyboard and mouse, yeah. I like the ticket machine. I like the way they put the money down. You actually have to take the money. I like that. And it's not always them two, two euro coins. They put money down as well, which is cool. Right, let me make sure it is actually capturing okay. It might not have saved that graphical option. Yeah, no, it has. Okay. So we're playing in 4K Ultra now, which is going to push it, really, isn't it, in early access? Um, we'll see how it behaves. Yeah, bus sim is five view console access, and you're going to get bus sim 21 soon as well, aren't you? Okay, tell me if you can see any difference on the stream in terms of um, clarity and I mean all that there. You know that all looks good, doesn't it? <laughs> There's houses and stuff over there. I like the way they've gone for depth of detail. There's a lot going on. Yeah, let me know how it's running in 4K. Obviously, wait till we're on the road. Why, well, what's up, Max? Oh, because you did your test. There you go. Right, let's start this up. Two, eight, nine. Totally, there is a difference even in the reflection. Oh, that would be cool. At least we can show you um, what it looks like even better. There you go. Yeah, they kind of. I've got a Titan X, the, the first one, but I've got a Titan X. Okay, single AB Bosch. Um, take their money and give her one back. Yeah, I'll give you one. There you go. <laughs> Thanks, Transport. I like the way you can do the doors individually as well. You got a bit of fabric at the back of your throat. Have a drink, Max. Have a drink, son. So you think it looks better on the stream in 4K, does it? This is the beauty of PC though, you know, we're running it in 4K. Um, <laughs> you'd love to give her one. All right, David. Um, we're running it in 4K, we're running it in Ultra. We've got every bloody mirror on possible. <laughs> in fact, we don't need that left-hand mirror, do we, really? I, I, don't, I don't want that. Yeah, I don't want that. There you go. Try the vents. Oh, God. All right, all right. You, you, you want the vents? Let's do the vents. Oh, God. You and your vents. It's like you get excited over it. There you go. Look, we can move them about. So let's see which one we are actually... Which one are we are moving? Oh, get out, Bush. Looks like we're doing the front one there, isn't it? Yeah, let's go back there. Yeah, here's the front one. It's so cool. I love that. I love the fact you can change the, the vents. It's ridiculous, isn't it? Because they're not real bloody vents, are they? But it's cool. <laughs> vents and on my way is all we need. Early access vent simulator. Yeah, you can see why people, you know, why people go to PC for Sims because you've got so much more, you know, control, haven't you, you know? Oh, there is an AI bus. We found an AI bus. Look, it might be parked and it might be as bright as anything, but we have found one. Do you think it looks better for the stream in 4K? You can feel the extra air. It's a bit funky back there, is it? I mean, come on, look at that, you know? Yeah, I'm really surprised and just pleasantly surprised with the graphical detail. And of course, you know, you do need the machine to put that amount of detail in. You can slide everything right down. This is absolutely as max as it'll go now. 4K Ultra, um, full traffic density, full passenger density. This is as good um, uh, as the game will allow you at the moment. And it actually seems to be running... Um, running all right you're going to get this in phase three i think really realistically the best time to get this would be in phase three when they introduce um the economy behind it yeah yeah i really do 
unless you're a big fan of uh, bus games, then fill your boots. You're going to love it. But um, yeah, fa phase three is the one you want. The beading dots of the rim. Uh, look at the window behind you, or to the side. The beading dots of the rim of it is also... What do you mean by the beading dots? What do you mean? What do you mean? Let's open the window. I love that. I love the fact you can open the window. Look. Window goes closed. Window goes open. Window is closed. Window's open. <laughs> no, I'm leaving the vents, yeah. Have you got fraps to check that? I haven't, no. I've got the one in steam, which um, seems to have turned itself off. We can't breathe in the back here. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, look around the rim of the window. Yeah, I got you. I got you. What is it, like the little black perforated dots? Yeah, oh, oh I see what you're saying. The little black, um, almost like perforated dots. Yeah, I understand what you're saying. Yeah, totally understand. Yeah, that is some good detail, isn't it? <laughs> Passenger becomes a bit nervous. Right, we haven't seen this, have we? You know, we haven't seen this at all. They got Doritos. I mean, have they got official license in here? That is actually their logo, isn't it? Wow, they got Dorito. What? They got Doritos in it. I've never seen stuff like that in a in a um, official release before. Like mods and stuff, yeah. Is this the airport? Is it? No, maybe not. Doesn't say how many people um, will do multiplayer, Neil. It just says phase two will be able to do that. I mean, look at this road design here. This is pretty epic, isn't it? This is an airport, isn't it? Surely that's an aircraft control uh, panel, isn't it? <laughs> it does look photorealistic in places, yeah. Yeah, I'm very impressed. Let me just check something. We are going the right way. Oh, yeah, look. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we're going to go up there. Nice. Yeah, we're heading to the airport. Love it. There's just no... There's, there's a wealth of detail, isn't there? Yeah, there's a wealth of detail. And a lot of people as well. A lot of people. I mean, check that out. Tower, tower, yeah. <laughs> Chips and burgers making me hungry. I know. So we will be able to do um, airport runs. You know I like that. Yeah, you know I like that. Puts us in holiday mode, I know. We don't need to play tourist bus anymore. I like it, Jig. Yeah, I like it, yeah. Uh, what's Craig saying? I've had word from the publisher... Fabian said no, you know, it's not planned. So you know, we can we can jazz it up however you want. But he said no. We can say yes, but um, I don't think it's going to happen. <laughs> there you go, route complete. I think that's shown you enough tonight, isn't it? Uh, no, you don't get a reset message. No, no, you don't, David. No. Yeah, I think we'll we'll play this again maybe during the week, um, just before it comes out. I really enjoyed this tonight. Yeah, I really did. Um, hopefully you did as well. Hopefully the main job of the channel is it just lets you know, A, it's here. B, is it worth getting on? C, what are you buying into? And if it's any good for you, that's the most important thing. But uh, I definitely enjoyed that. And I will be keeping a keen eye on this game all the way um, to completion. But that is it, everyone. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. I'm off now to watch um, uh, In the Line of Duty, which is a new series out tonight. But uh, yes, thank you for watching. I will be back tomorrow with an indie game for you, which I'm quite excited to play. Um, and I think you'll enjoy as well. So uh, thank you, everyone. Have a lovely weekend. See you next time.